Nope. 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 Ooh, no. Mom, are you oh. in the recycling bin again? Yes, I am, Oster, because this week on the Curated Crayon, we're going to make recycled cardboard sculptures out of things such as paper tubes, like paper towel rolls or toilet paper rolls. Make sure they're clean first. Get help from a grown-up going through recycling. Don't just go digging through it, please. And it looks like I even found my son may have already made a recycled cardboard sculpture, not even knowing it was this week's project. All right, it's hot and sunny here, so we're going to go inside and get started on our project. Meet you upstairs. Boom. All right, now that we have our materials, we are ready to begin. Now, I want to tell you a little bit first before we begin, actually. I was inspired for this project by a picture of myself, probably was about age 11 or so, so some of the, the age of some of my viewers. Um, I made this futuristic city for a science project at school, and I used all painted like cardboard uh, paper tubes, so toilet paper, paper towel rolls. I had tin foil on it. It was a lot of fun. So anyhow, here's the materials you're going to need besides the rolls. You're going to need some scissors, some paints, ideally pick some colors you love. I did for mine, some paint brushes. And the first step that you're going to do is you're going to decorate your tubes. Paint them as you'd like. I did horizontal and vertical stripes because I thought that would be fun and look kind of neat using my favorite colors. Make sure they've dried really well. Um, once they're dry, you can take them, give them a little pinch, not too much. They do tend to bounce back a little bit to their circular form, but you don't want to pinch them too much. And if you're a kiddo and this is a little harder to cut, you can always get help from a grown-up. And you're just going to cut them like this. And they like to pop and move around everywhere. See, just take a little cut like this. And you get your pieces. So these are going to be the pieces for how you build your cardboard sculptures. So I have some finished pieces here. You can make it as big or as little as you want. Um, it's a little bit of a, a, a um, check, a, oh, what is the word I'm looking for? a feat in um, engineering because sometimes you'll pile them up on top of one another and they won't stay. Um, so you have to keep rebuilding it. The one way to help you do that, I found, is I cut little slits in the cardboard. That makes a big difference. So I cut two little slits here. And then I kind of figure out, as I'm stacking them, how do I get that to stay? See, we have a little bit of a base already. And what you're going to do now is you're going to see, where could I put a little cut in here to make it stand? Look at that. So all I did to make this one stand up is I put a little slit in the cardboard. And I can keep doing that with all my pieces here just to make it stand. Oop. Sometimes you got to keep redoing them. You can use glue if you want, but I find it's fun to try to see what will stay without the help of glue. And let's see, oh, I have one. This one has a little slit in it already. There we go. We're going to build like that. And then let's see, let's add a slit to that one. Let's see if I can get it to stick, see, like that. And like that, and it's getting taller and taller as we work. I'm so focused, I almost forget to look up to see my my audience because it really is a little bit of an engineering feat there we go oh oh almost wants to move there we go I got it to stay up yay and they may topple over a lot of times and again it's just a matter of cutting little slits in your circles and seeing where they'll fit as you build and build it's just another way to build it's so creative so fun and if you don't like it, you can always take it down and build it again. So that is a simple recycled cardboard sculpture. Hope you had fun with them this week. Get creative, paint them up, have fun, de-stress, and just make art. Great for kids, great for grown-ups. And I'll see you next week on the Curated Crayon. Bye for now. Oh, it stood up. Yay! See, they're all standing. Yay! Oh, I'm going to have you edit out a bit of this.